Hello, and well, welcome to Up Level Academy's Let's Master Tutoring. So one of the questions that I always get asked is how to choose a tutor. And more specifically than that, I always get the question, you know, should I choose a tutor um, for English who has a degree in English? And I think it's a, a great question to ask because many parents um, are bombarded with fantastic educators and it can be re really difficult to decide who to go with. So I always like to think of um, an analogy. If you had a broken leg, you wouldn't go to a vet, right? You would go to a hospital. Now, if we wanted to look at it another way, again, if you broke your leg, well, you're not going to go and see a psychologist. You're going to go and see A&E, accident and emergency, and you're going to see a doctor, potentially a surgeon, depending on the break, right? But my point is, you're going to see an expert, a specialist in that field. And so while there are educators who are fantastic, who are very well versed in essay writing. So they might have a degree from fantastic universities, from Oxford, from Cambridge, from other Russell Group universities. And they may have a degree in philosophy. They may even have a master's degree or PhD in things like philosophy, economics, history, geography. And so, yes, what does that mean? Well, it means, yes, they can research. Yes, they can write an academic essay. Those are skills that are fundamental and are essential and key for English. But it doesn't mean that they will know English to a high level. There's a reason why there's a degree in English. And there's a reason why we at Up Level Academy only have tutors who are specialists in English, who have a degree in English, because it's more than just being able to write an essay and to research. If it wasn't, then how comes many students don't do so well, even with a tutor? And there's so much information out there, right? You can go on YouTube, you can just Google search. There's so much information on set texts, you know, Romeo and Juliet, Macbeth, The Sign of Four, and Inspector Calls. There's so much information. So it's not that. And equally, many students know the fundamentals of what to include in an essay. So it's not that. What's missing is the how. And with a degree in English, it teaches you not only the nuances of the subject, but more importantly than that, it also covers how to um, teach that, how to um, go into detail. And that is the key thing that's missing too often. And it's because of what that English degree gives educators. It gives them that in-depth understanding of the subject so that they're able to impart that um, to their tutees. And I think that's really important. Um, when looking and deciding for tutor. So to be very blunt and honest, does it matter whether your child's tutor, tutor for English, whether your child's tutor for English has a degree in English? Yes. In my expert opinion, yes, it does. Um, personally, for my, my children, I would want them to, if they're studying English, I want them to work with somebody who has a degree in English. If they're doing maths, I want them to have a maths degree because that tells me that they're passionate about their subject, they doing, that they know it inside out, that they've invested time to master it. And that means they're gonna impart that with your child too. So I hope that helps. Remember to like and subscribe to the channel and let us know if you have any questions. Bye for now.